There is a great sentiment, and I, I, in some respects, they lead the lead the market in terms of the valuations that they had on their producers and developers were ahead of where we were in Australia. But um, in terms of what, what's attractive to, to North America, um, recently there was the Northern Star Salt, the Platonic Mine, and that was an old mine. It's been around 25 years, and it ended up being sold into North American hands, and it was the first IPO on the TSX in two years. So, so I've said a little while ago that uh, our bottom was in 2015. We had four IPOs on, on the gold side. Um, we had seven in last year and we've had nine year to date. The TSX hadn't had an IPO for two years. And then the only IPO that gets up is in fact a producing mine, but it's an Australian asset. And that's got a 100 mil market cap at the moment. So that, 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 that's an amazing thing that it was so well received in, uh, in Canada. And um, would we have been able to do the same deal in Australia? Maybe not.